All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to One Game One Life. My name is Typo, and this is Starfield Part Twenty Four. And we have a couple more moons and Uranus itself to survey before we head over to our destination. Should not take too long, I wouldn't think, but let's find out. These Uranus moons are going really fast. Should just be some survey data money and some experience, of course. Whoa, what? Oh my god. We can help out, we can help out. Okay, okay. Oh yeah, these guys are doomed. Whoops, I just fired a missile without locking on, that's not good. And there you have it. Nope. Anyway, we can repay you. Um. Credits would be appreciated. You got it. Transferring now. Hell yeah! Eighteen hundred credits, just like that. That's awesome. You're welcome for the backup. Oh, I love that. We got to be space pirates for the good guys. That's right. I don't have to get up on it like that. Iridium. I don't think we have that much. So sure, I'll humor that. And then this. Stop it. Damn it. Stop targeting that. I'm trying to go somewhere else. Thank you. Uh, more uranium, please. Alright, let me stand up here. What's going on with the car gold? Let me loot my salvage here. And you're being difficult. I'm not having it. Hmm. There, now pick up what I tell you to pick up. Whoops. That freed up like four pounds. You should be able to pick up a couple more uranium now. There we go. Is there a third? Or is it just the two? We don't need that. Uh, I guess that's it. Just those two? The third one didn't drop anything? Alright. Fair enough, I suppose. I love how willing they were to pay us, though. That was great news. Alright. So, anyway. Let's go ahead and scan it. 90%. Go land on it. Wait, spaceship debris! There's an actual location on this one! And civilian outpost! Let's go to the civilian outpost first. I bet that has something for us. Wait a minute. This moon has, like, actual activity on it. I can't believe it. Surveying, it's gonna be easy, but maybe they'll have a side quest for us. To go to the other location on the moon, maybe. I would imagine that's what it is. Synapse Alpha is worn off. Yeah, I believe it. Alright, so we still have 10% experience for 6 minutes, but that's not going to last that long, obviously. Hey yo. I can't even imagine to tell you the number of inhospitable worlds like these that I've visited. You say inhospitable, but there's a civilian outpost right here, so... I don't know how inhospitable they consider it, Sarah. There's that. Let you know if I see anything, I guess. That sun is in our face, isn't it? Thing's not messing around. Alright, here's a resource. I'm not gonna keep gathering it. Switches to the cutter when we go into this mode. Whatever. We'll get water at some point during this journey up here. For doing whatever the civilian outpost might have in for us. And maybe they don't have anything for us, but I'd be shocked if they don't. Hey guys. Got a moment to spare? Yes, I do. 
What's going on? Hi there, traveler. Could you spare a moment? Of course. We're worried about the gas rising from the vents nearby. We want to make sure it's safe. We need some assistance placing these sensors near the vents. Interested? Sure. <laughs> no problem. I was just going to wander around aimlessly anyway. It's not the most glamorous work, but it is important. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, that's funny and so true. It's like they knew. Place gas sensor. Set mission to active. All right, sure. That one's out there, though. Let's do these first. Okay, there's one. It's not glamorous work, but someone's got to do it. Okay, place device. Got it. No, it's definitely toxic gas, my man. I can tell you right now on the scanner, you don't you don't need these devices for that. A little friendly advice from me to you. That's that's definitely that's definitely not good. What? What's going on here? Was I supposed to set another one up over here? I guess. Okay. That was four out of five sensors? Oh. Well then. Glad I could help. This this one over here is the last one, apparently. And I guess they're not going to send me over to the other uh, planet. Or the other area on this moon. Interesting vertical rockscapes here? Huh. Why are they worried about this one? This one's really far away, to be honest. I mean, I guess... If it's somewhat windy on this planet, it could get there eventually, but... Not not looking like the highest priority target, if you ask me. Place the device. I ain't seeing no water, by the way. Would love to get that water resource knocked out. Okay, it's too far away. We'll just we'll just get it at the other location we need to drop by anyway. The spaceship scrapyard or whatever it was called. Vapor analysis. Return to the colonist. This felt like an MMO quest. I'm not gonna lie. This this mission uh lackluster is a word I would give it. But okay, all right, fine. I guess I can do that as long as you pay me well and give me the XP. I guess I'll play along. There, I did your gig. Don't stand next to that. It's going to blow you up. Thanks for everything. Feel free to visit any time. Why do you live here? Here, take this. 2,000 credits and 165 experience. It's the best I can do. Stay safe out there. I don't understand why you would live here. Of all the places. Of all the places, you choose here. That's just torture to yourself. Why would you do that? Oh man, we are... We got that height right now. Boost. 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 There we go. Got a long distance off that one. Alright, so now we need to go back to the other area. I'm not going to that. To the other area that was already on this planet. Moon, sorry. Keep saying planet when it's a moon. And pray that we find some water while we're there. Because that would be very convenient if we managed to do that. Alright. The next spot. I feel so good getting all this survey data done and getting all this experience and all these spare credits. I feel like I'm getting ahead of the game, is the feeling it gives me. Which I kinda am, at least <laughs> compared to where the game expects me to be according to the story, would be my guess. I mean, we're on a level one system right now. Soul is a level one system, that's what it says. And we're level 16. 
feels nice. Okay, go to the other one now. Spaceship Debris, that's what it was called. Walter Stroud. Let's find some water while we're here. Wow, we are really close to that area right there. I like it. Alright. Here we go. What do we have? Yeah, well rested just ended. What is it like sleeping here? No shot. We'll sleep in space. Oh, that's unknown? That's not where we're going? Where are we going? Spaceship debris there? Well, I'm going here too then. It's, it's very nearby. And it doesn't take us away from the spaceship debris. It gets us a little closer to it, so... Let's kill some spacers or pirates or whatever is going to be here. Get some loot and then head towards the debris, I guess. Still no water, though. That's a concern. We've hit a facility that looks like this before. Yep, it's going to be spacers. Yep. Wow, do you see the hidden bar is already going away a bit? That's kind of crazy that they can kind of see us from here. Yeah, these maps get recycled and I don't love that, but you know. When you're trying to fill a whole galaxy with locations, I guess. I, I don't know, you could still like make AI generated stuff. You know? Be like, here's the building blocks, AI, go make it. Still feel like that's better than seeing the same place over and over. But it also makes sense that there'd be a universal design for these places, so I buy that, I guess. I'm busted, they know. There you are. Bye. Two ammo left, so we basically got to switch. I'm not leaving any of that behind. You're crazy if you think I'm leaving that behind. All right, we got to get in the facility, though. Whoa, Sarah, what? Are you, how are you already in here? It's kind of weird. Okay. Ooh, the headshot on the third one. Spacer Communication 2. The low gravity does make it fun sometimes. And by sometimes, I mean all the time. All the time. Spacer Punk. Oh my god, I'm getting toasted. That hurt a lot. Damn, sir. Whatever that gun is that you have that's doing, like, incendiary damage, that thing is cooking. Okay. No one else in here? Which means the one over there is kind of what we're looking at right now. Is there a guy below or above us? Must be above us. Yep, there he is. Headshot. Done. Is this guy cowardly? Oh, they were waiting for me to turn the corner. Done. Thanks, guys. More 43 Ultra Mags. Nice. Okay. Alright. Excellent. Wait, The Origin of Species is a super valuable book. Yeah. Take that. Digipick, we love those so much. Hypolycia. See, these lockers can really kick sometimes. Three cred sticks. Yes. Yes, Sarah. Yes, this was worth. Squall. Squall must be some kind of food, maybe? 
Bastion Stealth Calibrated Equinox. 1,800 credits on that man, too. What resource is that, do you think? Okay, we wiped out those guys. Okay. And then the door right back there is the one we got to pick lock. Lock pick, whatever you want to call it. We already looted him. Oh my god, I can't drop down these stairs. Okay. Bat ball cap? I'll pass. Alright, I think that is it. Yeah. Other than going up or going in the locked room. Fair enough. Let's go up then. They just fly about, don't they? A lot of 50 caliber is picked up here. When I find a really good 50 caliber weapon, I'm gonna be... Harvested Organs is 3 mass for 13,500 credits. You've picked up a contraband item. These are illegal to have on you or in your ship. Security ships orbiting major settlements will scan your ship for contraband and will not let you land until the scan is complete. You have a chance of smuggling contraband past them. If you fail, you can be arrested and have your contraband confiscated. Wow. Okay, so don't take it somewhere, like, big. Take it somewhere small. Or somewhere that doesn't do contraband. That's cr That's crazy. Whoa. That's too much money to not try. Boom pop cola. Oh, wait, I do like cola. Sure. Alright, now we try to lock pick the one door and then we leave. Expert. Alright. That's gonna be a lot. we do this, we would need four more. They would fit there. That would fit. Would it work for the rest of them, though? We'll find out. Okay. A double and a single, yeah. And then a double and a separated. Not that separated. Uh-oh. Oh, got it. Here we go. Perfect. Nice. We're in. 15 locks. You know what that means. Yes. Master lock picking. Yes. <laughs> All right. Expended digit pick to eliminate keys that aren't required to solve the puzzle. Five auto attempts can be banked. Hey. Hey. I don't think I'm going to take rank 4. I think I'm just going to be happy that I can finally pick master level locks and now I can get anywhere I damn well please. We could do boost pack expends less fuel. I don't know. I, I'd want to see how good the other the other thing is first. Thanks for the cred sticks. Okay. About a thousand credits there. Explosives. Shotgun shells. Cartridges, modified calibrated solstice, but it's not advanced, so who cares? Some gold, okay. Too many odds and ends. Time to I got encumbered. That's fine. Feel free to drop some stuff into my next bag. shop is the next stop is the moon, Luna. All right, go ahead and take these for me, Sarah. Thank you. And then take this for me. Thank you. And take these for me. Thank you. How would they scan you for confiscate for organs? How would they even scan you for that? I'm a little confused by that detail. Goodbye. I have organs. How do you know they're confiscated? Anyway, radioactive barrow knife. I almost missed this whole chest. This thing is hidden for me. This doesn't look like a chest to me. Not enough green lights, but okay. Nine platinum as well. Thank you. Oh, really glad I didn't miss that because that would have sucked to miss. All right, good run, everybody. These lockers can be really good. I gotta look. See? Cred sticks. Fantastic. Worth opening all those lockers for sure. Yep, 
All that for a thousand credits? <laughs> I'll do that every time. If opening lockers got me a thousand credits every 20 seconds, I'd be out here busting them open constantly. Alright, now we go to the spaceship debris. So that's exciting that we haven't even got to where we were trying to get to yet. A little worried about the water problem. Still looking for that. Where is it hiding? More copper. Just really hoping something blue pops up. And not you guys, but thank you for trying. <laughs> 75 credits. It's something. Now what is this going to be? I don't think we've seen a spaceship debris map before. I think that's new. What do we have here? That's definitely a downed spaceship. Can't argue with that. I'm not seeing any people. Really? That seems odd. Why would there be no people? Someone's set up right here. That looks like alien. I <laughs> that looks like aliens. 74 credits. Like uh, the alien franchise with the xenomorph and stuff. Ship parts. <sighs> Heavy, but I want it. What's a drilling rig? Rare manufactured component. No. No, I'll have to pass on these. Thanks, though. What was the point of this? Why did you bring me here? Did someone just want to put this on the map? Like, one of the creators was like, I want to have a crashed spaceship. Okay, but like, this was marked on my map as somewhere like, that would suggest important, right? Hold up, what is this? Storage box, damn. Lubricant. <laughs> okay, not what I was looking for, but alright. Copper again. Is that really it? guess that's it. Well, damn. Let me double check a bit, but that looks like it. I can't believe those organs are in our inventory right now. Harvested organs. Why? Wait, wait, wait. Water! Titania survey data added. We got it at the end. Very nice. Okay. Works for me. If it works, it works. Alright, I'll see y'all back in the ship. We did it. On to the next. There was one more moon, I believe. And then Uranus itself, I don't know if you can actually land on Uranus, but I I guess you could if it's like a straight ice, you know? That cargo load is full. Maybe I'll take some of these off its hands so it can fit more ship parts. Because I can't use the ship parts if they're not in here, right? There you go. 
Yeah, that should that should do it. Okay, and we'll have to give those resources to uh, Sarah, I guess. I gotta figure out where I can land and where I can't for contraband. But I couldn't leave those harvested organs behind. They're just too valuable. They'll sell like... Those will sell for like 2,000, maybe a little over 2,000 at Trade Authority. Because I'm sure Trade Authority would take them. They take anything. <clears throat> Miranda, last one. Set a course. And then Uranus itself, and then we'll go to the moon, Luna. Looks like everything's peaceful here. A trait! And two resources. Ah, Miranda's got a little something for us. Well, let me go ahead and <clears throat> get some shut eye. And then we'll hit Miranda. What is it, day 19 in the game right now? Dude, Sarah's been traveling with us for over a week at this point. And I think she's like, can we get on it, please? Why are we still doing this? No, it's day 18, okay. Which means we have enough sleep, I believe. 102. 17. Yeah. Yep. We have the right amount of sleep. Perfect. Oh, thank you. I believe that's a good thing. <laughs> Probably. Most likely. Unless we're under attack, I guess. That asteroid is on the move. Okay. We gotta find an ecological survey. Where do we feel like we could find one of those? I don't think we're gonna get any hints. So let's just land and try our best. I bet Uranus will have uh, ecological surveys too. We'll have to look for an unknown marker. That's a cool view, by the way. We'll have to look for an unknown marker and see what we can find. Extreme cold, I know. We don't need cave. We need unknown, yeah. We don't need a building. We don't need a building. Alright, I guess we go this way. That's our best bet. And we'll have to get the lead in the water on the way. There's one of them. Nice water. That's usually the harder one, so. Good we got that. It's mineral! Does it really have these giant crystals on it? Because that would be really cool. If real life Miranda had these giant ass crystals on them. I guess I'll see y'all there. I guess you don't you don't need to be here for this. That's cool. Unexplored ge geophysical feature. That's what we're talking about. Just knock it out, and there's the lead. Whoa, what is that? Miranda, what are you working with out here? Organ non Organa nitrogen vents? Volatile gases are ejected from the oscillating slushy ocean deep below the, the frozen surface. Oh. Can I get anything from that? Or is it just dangerous? Uh, uh, no, I don't, I don't, I'm not, I'm not jumping in that. Hard pass, 
Hard pass. I think I can stop picking up uranium now because I think we got it. Surf subsurface seas. Very cool. Alright, mission accomplished. Back to the ship. There's the moon surveyed. I love it when a plan comes together like that, where you just go to the first unknown you can find and it actually happens to be what you're looking for. Who made all these stations? No matter where you land in this entire solar system... That looks really cool, actually. There's always a station. What? What is that doing up there? Huh. Did you look at that? Anyway, sorry, like I said, back to the ship. Tell you what, if we never see a location like that on a different moon or planet, we might go explore that just to see what we're missing there, because we'll probably find something like that in the future, but if we don't, we always we can already go back. We can always go back. We know where this is. It marked our landing spot. Interesting. Alright, now Uranus, and then the moon. Pleasant change of scenery. Sure. If and you say so. I do like discovering ecological surveys. I feel like that's really cool that they have those in these in this game. Travel to Uranus. Oh boy. Are we gonna be able to do this? Here it is. Kind of a big deal. Surveyed! <laughs> Let's go! I did the survey for Uranus! Easy. Well, all right then. Like I promised, let's go do what we're supposed to do now. Um, abandoned robotics facility. Cool. And what does Earth have for us? Anything? Anything marked? Nothing's marked? Damn, son, that's bummer. There is Mercury, definitely. All right, fine. Sensor contact. Huh. Okay, yeah, we've done all of Mars, we've done all of Uranus, we've done all of Venus, we've not done all of Mercury, which does have locations on it, a forgotten mech graveyard. But we can do that after we deal with, uh... Man, I, it kinda, it's kind of weird to go through the sun, you know what I mean? Alright, let's go do Mercury real quick. <laughs> but you said, I know! I know! But I don't want to fly through the sun, you all understand, right? You can't fly through the sun, that'd be ridiculous. So we'll do this, and then we'll go to the moon. 100 experience, damn. Okay, I see you. What is this? Excuse me, do you have a minute? I'm a scientist, I could use some help with my research. Hello there, and thank you for sure. responding to my hail. It's been a long time since I had company. I'm Dr. Sola Banglawala from Mast in New Atlantis. I'm okay. performing a geological Banglawala. survey of the settled systems as part of a field research initiative. Okay. I flagged you down to see if you might have any rare geological samples to contribute. Contribute? Can I expect any kind of compensation? Of course. Fair is fair. My research produces a lot of common inorganic materials as byproducts. I'm happy to offer you some copper, lead, or aluminum. Hard pass. I could also pay you if you'd prefer credits, but I'm on a research scientist's budget, so don't expect much. Yeah, I want paid, please. You said it's been a long time since you had company. Are you out here alone? Yes, I am. I've been out here for weeks without anyone to talk to. Most of the pilots I've tried hailing have either shot at me or flown off. What? My food and water supplies are fine, but I didn't bring nearly enough books to keep myself busy. <laughs> you can only read Pride and Prejudice so many times. 
Right. After my third time through it, I started using the pages to teach myself origami. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um. Help if I can? You better not give random rocks. I can't thank you enough. I'm in the market for lithium, platinum, and vanadium right now. I'm not asking for much. I know they're hard to come by. I have some spare platinum. It's all yours. Pay me. No, you have no idea how much I appreciate this. Thank you very much. I'd be happy to offer you some of the common resources produced as byproducts of my research to thank you for your help. No. Credits. I have more copper, lead, and aluminum than I know what to do with. I'll pay you in credits instead, if you prefer, but uh, I don't have much. Credits. I'll take the not much credits, please. I'll take the credits. That works for me. My budget's pretty small, but I can spare a few. Transferring to you now... Looks like it just went through. I'm going to try my luck in another system. Oh! You might want to back up a bit. This old junker's grav drive is a little on the fritz. Fly safe! That was... That was not a good idea. I, okay, well now I know for the future, don't help out Sorry, doctors. Taking longer than usual. You're stuck. So, do you have any hobbies? <laughs> Plenty, I'm a jack of all trades. Does your list include towing research vessels to Jemison through deep space? If my grab drive doesn't start up soon, it might have to. <laughs> <laughs> Personally, I have quite a rock collection. I used to spend my weekends gathering samples on Jemison. Maybe I shouldn't have let that slip at the office, huh? <laughs> That's probably why they sent me on this job instead of some poor grad student. <laughs> You're stuck. It's not starting. Do you ever hear the one about the geologist and the music shop? What is happening? <laughs> a geologist walks into a music store and asks the cashier, Got any rock? The guy looks him up and down and says, There she goes. Yeah, never help a scientist on a scientist budget again. That was not worth my five platinum at all. Okay, we need to get the helium-3 aluminum and the neodymium at the forgotten mech uh, graveyard. Looks like the neodymium doesn't have a main area. Forgotten Mech Graveyard. <laughs> Not so forgotten if it's marked on my map, but thank you. Might have to land in a cave to be able to get the neodymium because it looks like it's a rarer resource. Is that where we're going? I see somebody already. We're still good on, uh, well-rested, absolutely. Alright, here we go. Does look good? Suit integrity normal. I think this place is worth the trouble. Same. Okay, there's the graveyard right there. Uh, I'm not seeing caves, which is, might be a problem. We'll see. Extreme ambient heat. Yeah, that makes sense on Mercury. Spacers. Oh. Oh my goodness. The poor bastard never saw it coming. Didn't even get to defend himself, the poor guy. Okay. Pizza square. What about the pizza roll? Get it? Because she was rolling. And pizza rolls are a food we eat. <laughs> Just laugh. Pity laugh, please. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, wait. Not me. Oh, my God. He's got the red health bars. He's got a special item on him. Crit in the leg. That's tough. Level 17? Nice. I'll take it. Level 17! We're kinda cruising. I don't know what this 939 ammo is, but... I'm taking it. We have- we're getting a lot of it. 
Where's that 11 millimeter ammo though for the uh, advanced AR-99? Because that's the weapon we really need to get going. You feel me? It's gonna sneak attack there. I think I just saw a guy. Yep. Ah. Okay. I don't have a reload. This is the end of this weapon right here. A boosted maelstrom. I wonder what that's all about. Forgotten mech graveyards this way? Huh. Not where any of the buildings are. Oh! Whoa! It becomes a cave! So that ship is crazy close. Hold up a second. I think it's right on top of us. Spacers? Or someone good? What do we think? Spacers. Oh my god, the aim right here. Oh! This thing's never this accurate. Okay, we have more Ultra Mags now. Oh my goodness! Oh, this guy got flown! Dude, our, our Solstice is never that accurate. We got lucky there. The spread was very generous. Wow, thanks guys. For donating to the cause, yeah. To the moon, shall we? If you have any soon. gear you want me to haul, I'm happy to help. Soon, 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 soon. Okay, uh, yep. I definitely have things I want you to haul. Here's some packs. Here's a helmet. Resources. And she's capped. What do you got? We're all capped. All of us are capped. Oh, God. That's what I was afraid of. <laughs> no, we're going to have to go back to Mars just to trade. But I think we get scanned at Mars, don't we? Do we get scanned at Mars? I don't know, but I'm glad this cave is here. Let's go find out what's going on here. Scavenger bur burrows? Oh, boy. I'm going to be over-encumbered when I leave here, aren't I? We're going to have to go make some trades happen. Though usually these caves are empty. I don't think it'll be that way this time. Some resources, maybe? Oh. Stuck in a cave. Set aside anything useful and just leave the rest. Uh, I think these guys died in here. <laughs> how, how are they stuck exactly? Explain. Stuck in a cave. I hate my life. Going here for some dumb salvage was a horrible idea, and these things creep me the hell out. There's so much more that we can carry out, the, out there. These things. The mechs. What do we se need to send anyone in here? So my bright idea was to draw straws. I figured the odds of me pulling a short straw would be pretty slim. Guess not. Pretty sure I'm bleeding internally, and I can't really move, so there's no way I'm getting out of here on my own. Just hope those jerks out there remember that I'm in here before leaving. They did not. Look at the... Uranus survey is only worth 4,500. Titania is worth that much. Spacer communication too. All spacers. You know who you are. Because that's what they call us, isn't it? The ones in charge. The ones who never respected us. The Free Star Collective, the United Colonies, even the Crimson Fleet and Ecliptic. They see us as the leftovers. The unaligned space scum running rampant across the settled systems. You know what? Maybe they're right. So what? We matter just as much as they do. We deserve just as much as they do. A lot of you have been all over. You've seen the empty buildings, labs, factories, whatever. They're out there, lots of them, abandoned after the colony war. And those others? They want them. They're taking them and everything inside. Are you gonna let them do that? You gonna let them get away with that? I'm not. 
I want my fair share. And I don't know about you, but I'm ready to take it. <clears throat> Damn. He's ready to go. Miranda's worth 9,000. Nice. So the places with the ecological surveys are worth a little extra. Okay. Uh, Sarah. Next stop. Want to see what I'm carrying? You... No, you can't carry anymore. That's right. Never mind. Forget Until it. Later. Just forget it. I'm over encumbered, though. There's aluminum. Whoa. Big mechs out here. I don't think there's going to be any enemies. Just a suspicion I'm having. Drilling rig, not going to need that. Nice! There's the neodymium. Hell yeah! I want to mine that. Give me that good stuff. Beautiful. I don't even know what that is, so... That's why I gotta get. I gotta get it. If I don't know what it is, that means I don't have it. Probably, most likely. More of it. That's a that's a two that's a tier two resource. Pharmaceutical kit. Empty. Yeah, I'm grabbing more of it. I don't know how much of this I'm gonna need. Score. Wow, why is there so much? For a tier 2 resource, we're finding plenty. Alright, and one more resource, and this place is... And Mercury is wrapped up. So that'd be great. If we could get that. And the mechs are a little spooky, but not too crazy. Hello, hello, hello. What do we have here? Alien genetic material. Vanadium and titanium. Yeah, we needed that. What the case? 27 what calibers. Junk you're hauling is seriously slowing you down. Yeah, but look what I can do. Anti-personnel modified side star. Worth selling. Really all I can say, but it's worth selling. Where have we gotten to? This place just keeps going. Oh. My. Goodness. Whoa. Is this where we were? I don't need aluminum. What am I doing? Yeah, that's where we were, right there. Wow. And it all looped back to here, I guess. We're still missing one of the resources that's supposed to be on this planet, though. Is it like water or something? Creature pile. Not what I was hoping for, but you know, I'll take it. 25 benzene cosmetics. Yep. Definitely take the cosmetics. Okay, anything else back here? Nope, the mech graveyard is just in the ground. Plenty of neodymium, which is a tier 2 resource, so I'm going to take that. I'm going to call it a tier 2 when it has those two diamonds like that, and then when it has none like aluminum, I guess I'll just call that a tier 0. And that'll be how I differentiate them. Yeah, alright, that's the whole place. Let's try to find one more resource outside, and then that's a wrap for this planet. And that's a planet, too, not just the moon. And then we gotta make some trades somewhere. What resource are we missing? Is it water? It's not water, it's helium-3. Where the hell am I gonna find helium-3? Apparently... 
in this area, especially if I go left. What? Really? All right, let's see what we can do. Show me the helium three. I'm ready. Yeah, the neodymium is not rare on this planet, so I'm going to stop harvesting that. Thought I saw movement there for a second. Oh, uh, shit, guys. I don't know. I don't know where to find the helium-3. What do you think, Sarah? Is that it? Please be it. Just a random vent, I guess. Is that a ship? Something over there. The thing is, I don't know. Helium 3 would be a gas, right? So it'd be in a cave, probably? There's no cave on our map. At least that'd be. Oh, there we go. Yes! Yes. There we go. Ouch. But we got it. Alright, Mercury surveyed. I'm going back to the frontier and I'll see y'all there. Woo! Good stuff. Alright, back on the ship. Over encumbered and everything. Okay. We're still good. Everything's good. We're doing good. <laughs> everything's great. A little over encumbered, but we're great. That was cool. Now, I can't believe it, but we have to go back to Trade Authority on Mars. I'm really hoping I don't get arrested for this cargo. That would really suck. Ooh, that sounds like a decent cliff cliffhanger, though. <laughs> Alright, so. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, consider giving it a like. If you really enjoyed it, consider subscribing. Either way, thank you so much for joining me on this journey in Starfield. And next time... Uh oh, I got, I got, I got stalled. Hailing? What's going on? What's going this on? This is a commercial passenger transport liner wanting to alert you about hostiles in the system. Ooh, okay. The space is. <laughs> Do you need any assistance? No, it gave our passengers a bit of a scare, but the ship's a okay. Okay. Space is never dulled. I'm glad you made it out in one piece. You and me both. Us friendlies have got to watch each other's backs out here. Safe travels, stranger. Huh. Okay. Is that actually on the map anywhere? Huh. Nice guy, I guess. As long as we don't get attacked while we're here. Would really suck.
What is this sound? I'm getting really paranoid. I'm <laughs> getting really paranoid. Let's just go to Mars and get arrested, maybe? I don't know. But yeah, I'll see y'all next time. <laughs>